Welcome. Today I'm going to present our new mobile cone crusher, the MobiCone MCO90 EVO 2. In contrast to the predecessor model, only one series is now required, which you can equip with a post-screening unit, directly X works, or later as a retrofit. This increases your flexibility considerably. In the development of the machine, the focal points were sustainability, operability, machine availability, and of course, the performance of the plant. I'd like to start by mentioning one highlight. Let's start with sustainability. We were able to significantly reduce noise emission as well as fuel consumption considerably. The revised operating concept Spective is integrated for better operability. And a new radio concept and Spective Connect, a digital solution, await you. In order to ensure high machine availability in the different applications, the MCO90 EVO2 is equipped with the software-based ring bounce detection. The machine also has the highest crusher drive power in this class. Let's take a closer look now at our new cone crusher. The plant not only has a new look, the chassis beam was extended and the overall plant has a somewhat more robust design. We were inspired by the big sister of the MCO 110 Pro. It's easy to recognize that the rear wall of the hopper is much steeper than in the predecessor plant. This helps to avoid material buildups and clogging, which is very beneficial, particularly in operation behind a primary crusher or an upstream plant, as the fine material falling from the scraper no longer sticks to the hopper. The hopper extension is installed at the plant. It can remain attached for transportation and does not have to be disassembled each time, as is often the case with many competitor plants. Alternatively, a hydraulically folding filling aid is available. This permits simple wheel loader feeding from behind. The volume of the basic hopper has also increased slightly compared with the previous plant. The MCO90 EVO2 can also be operated with a magnetic separator. A metal detector, which stops feeding in the event of an emergency, is on board as standard and also contributes to the high machine availability. In the front area, you can easily recognize that the material guides at the side, which previously had to be folded manually, are now permanently integrated in the hopper, and manual folding up and down for transportation is no longer required. This saves time and is much more convenient. I'd also like to mention the ground clearance in transport position, which was increased by half a meter and is particularly advantageous when loading onto the flatbed truck. The proven ceiling concept and the individually exchangeable elements of the impact bar were adopted from the predecessor series. What is also noticeable is that many competitors weld the impact bar into the hopper. Repairs are then always connected directly to welding and burning operations. At Clayman, everything is screwed and therefore maintenance friendly. The next highlight is our proven continuous feed system, CFS, which is well known from the predecessor machine. This ensures continuous crusher utilization by optimal feeding, up to 10% more daily output and better product quality. This is included in the scope of delivery for the MCO90 EVO2 as standard. The MCO90 EVO2 works in conjunction with our jaw crusher MC110 EVO2 in most applications. The line coupling option allows the two machines to be coupled with one another. The crushing process between the crushing plants is then optimized automatically, so that material is always conveyed with maximum efficiency through the machines. For safety reasons, the crushing and screening plants are connected to each other by a cable. The new KX250 Crusher combines a variety of innovations and improvements, which all aim to offer you the crucial added value. We differentiate ourselves from our competitors primarily by the wide range of applications, the increased operational safety and availability, as well as the highest drive power in this class. 
Thanks to increased efficiency in the power pack and the overhaul of the belt drive, we were able to increase the available drive power for the crusher. Not only are more tons of material crushed per hour, but a continuous crushing process is also achieved. Fewer throughput fluctuations at the end of the day lead to higher daily output. This is visible especially in the crushing of small material, that is in the tertiary range, where small feed sizes and narrow gap settings lead to increased power consumption. The result is more tons of final product per liter of diesel consumption. In terms of crushing capacity, we're well ahead on the market. Each one of you can easily calculate what financial advantages a higher crushing capacity brings. Our overhauled crushing tools complement this increased drive power perfectly and further increase the return. The maintenance of the crusher is also more comfortable. An additional maintenance window and the new crusher platform facilitate all maintenance and servicing measures considerably. We also streamlined the position of the clamping wedges for the crushing tools, so that there's now only one identical position for all tools, whether it's standard or shorthead. In addition, we received some details from the operators and implemented them directly, such as the automatic correct positioning of the inlet hopper when changing tool. The wide range of applications is very important. With our crusher and the various crushing tools, we can cover a gap setting range from 6 to 45 millimeters. With many competitors, time consuming and expensive conversion work at the crusher is required in order to realize such a wide range of applications. We also have an excellent solution for the familiar all-in feed in the industry with our ring bounce detection overload system. Good product quality is expected from a cone crusher and this product quality is delivered by our MCO90 EVO2 together with optimal output. On many competitor plants the gap setting opens erratically in the event of a latent overload and the quality of the final product is negatively affected by oversized grain. In this case, the crusher is protected from damage, but a stable process is not guaranteed. Unlike with the Kleeman ring bounce detection overload system, here the operator can choose between two modes and consciously allow oversized grain and thus favor a higher crushing capacity of the product quality or retain a stable gap setting and thus high product quality. This option also demonstrates the flexible and versatile use of the MCO90 EVO2. Apart from a modular belt concept, which simplifies the conversion from a short to a long belt, we completely redevelop the belt covers. The tarpaulin cover can be removed in a few hand movements by one person without the need for tools, meaning that you reach the belt and the ceiling quickly and easily without tools. This saves time and is very simple, thus facilitating the work. We also redesigned the accessibility to the crusher discharge conveyor and the crusher drive. A belt scale is available as optional equipment, both for the crusher discharge conveyor and the fine grain conveyor. The quantities produced can then be read off on the operator panel at the plant and in Spective Connect. With Spective Connect, a report can also be created and sent. Let's talk about the optional post-screening unit. Thanks to a significant improvement in the material transfer point, the material is now distributed much faster across the entire screening width. We were able to reduce the screening length by 0.5 meters with the same screening capacity. The transport height was reduced to 3.4 meters with this reduction of the screening length. Depending on the country, this lowers transport cost considerably or allows the issue of permanent driving permits. If you want to regularly move the oversized grain from the process, there is the oversized grain return conveyor, which can also be swiveled hydraulically. 
The MC-090 EVO 2. Like the MC-110 EVO 2, the MC-090 EVO 2 has an optimized drive concept. A modern diesel generator with power transfer box and controlled fan drive ensure less consumption and more efficiency, as well as unique accessibility. The optional elevation of the air intake reduces the service and cleaning effort, lowers operating costs, and increases the machine availability. Everything can be folded in a few hand movements for transportation and quickly put back into operation again at the next construction site. We were also able to reduce the noise emission significantly. This is a big audible improvement, especially for our operators. The Spective operating concept was further improved. Apart from the revised touch panel, we now offer two intuitively operated radio remote controls. Firstly, a large radio remote control, with which the entire machine can be set up from a safe distance. And secondly, a small radio remote control, with which the user can operate all relevant functions in automatic mode from the excavator. The whole thing was upgraded with Spective Connect. Spective Connect is the logical extension of our operating concept and offers genuine added value. With this digital application, all operating data can be transmitted directly to a mobile end device via Wi-Fi. The operator therefore has all relevant information, messages and troubleshooting options directly on site and can send clear reports. There are many more details, such as the newly developed drive system, which is driven directly by the diesel engine. As a result, the driving speed increased by 60% compared with the EVO 1, and the plant can be controlled very precisely, which facilitates loading and positioning in the plant train considerably. Refueling from the ground, both for diesel and Ad Blue, is also standard at Clayman, but not necessarily a given for other machines on the market. The central drainage point for cooling water, engine oil, transmission oil, as well as fluid coupling oil is also new. With our EVO 2 plants, for maintenance activities you no longer have to open a screw fitting on your knees in the power pack in order to drain the media. Everything can be done safely and cleanly from the ground. We also further developed the lubricating oil unit and created additional added value. And also here we attach huge importance to the easy maintenance of the machine. For example, through automatic emptying of the lubricating oil tank when an oil change is pending. The service time can be reduced considerably here, as the oil can be pumped directly into an oil drum or a similar container. This lowers the operating costs and increases the availability of the plant. In addition, the lubricating oil unit now also heats up the oil approximately 20% faster. This means that production can be started earlier, which quickly becomes noticeable in an average winter month. Accessibility in the area of the lubricating oil unit and the bend pulley from the crusher discharge conveyor speaks for itself. Finally, we want to mention the advantages achieved by the compact design of the machine. We have very short setup times, meaning a fast change of location and a faster production start are possible. Thanks to our new radio remote control, all these activities can be carried out at a safe distance with an optimal view of the machine. In addition, no parts have to be disassembled for transportation, thanks to hydraulic folding functions. Another advantage is the reduced transport height of 3.40 meters which we already mentioned. Depending on the country, transport costs can be lowered or permanent driving permits can be issued. Innovative solutions such as the new radio remote control or Spective Connect were developed in cooperation with users. If you would also like to assist us in future product developments, we would be delighted to receive your registration via our website. We're convinced that our new operating concept, in conjunction with our new EVO 2 crushing plants, are a strong, complete package. I hope that I was able to provide you with a good overview of the new MCO90 EVO 2.
Should you have any questions, please get in touch with your Witkin group contact or use the direct feedback option on our website. I look forward to hearing your feedback.